Yes, science! This video was edited and produced by the Patinator himself. I release this video for educational purposes only. I reserve the right to my own innovations made upon existing technologies exhibited here in this video. Hello, my name is Daniel Bain. I'm 18 years old and I built hogs. Time for assembly was seven hours. Research took three days to complete and consisted of 35 different web pages. Reflection allows for the fog screen to work. Light from the projector produces an image that bounces back from the medium it hits. Diffraction can be seen in the shadow left by the base of the fog screen and it can be seen in just where the light peeks over the draw. Now the prototype you've been seeing is actually the second of three. Um, the first of which is this big guy right there. Put out half the volume of smoke and nowhere near the clarity of image. And the third little guy you may not have noticed is right there. Get a little closer to this guy. He's handheld and produces equal clarity to the second one. Powered by a small fan and about 30 straws. I see this eventually becoming the size of a uh, an iPhone case. In fact, the next stage is put all this inside of that little case right there. Portable hologram. Let it snow, let it snow. Refraction can be seen when viewing the image from sides other than the front or back. The image is distorted, and this has two reasons. One, the laminar flow meets a certain threshold for air friction, and the air manifests entropy, or disorganized energy, in the form of turbulence. The second is a refraction of the image. This is similar to how the rainbow forms. However, the vapor is far more dense and translucent than water, which is almost entirely transparent in vapor form. The light bends a bit, making it difficult to see the original image with any clarity. This leads me to interference. Here we have both constructive and destructive interference. Fog's refraction of light makes highly detailed images difficult to see clearly, and as for destructive interference, we can see this as we change mediums from fog to air, that the image is no longer reflecting. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed my video. See you later!